Hi guys, welcome to Empower In. My name is Caroline Porter Thomas. Thank you so much as usual for watching my YouTube channel. And welcome to Motivation Monday. In this Motivation Monday, I'm going to tell you my number one secret to decreasing sugar cravings. Now I do have a few things that I do. One of the things that I do on a daily basis is I do drink fresh green juice. Um, sometimes, ideally, I do juice every day. Um, every now and then I have to do it where I make a batch load and I'll do that every three days or so. It just depends on what's going on in my life and I have to pretty much arrange around that. When I do juice, what this is in here right now is cucumber, celery, avocado, spinach, lemon, and ginger. So that is a juice that I, I drink every day and that has really helped me with my sugar cravings. But I think more than anything, what has really, really helped me is that an avocado. Literally when I just eat eat an avocado a day and I literally just cut it and scoop it out and eat it just like that, I find such a better control of like any type of cravings. And it also seems to level out my blood sugar. Not only that, I also noticed a big difference in my skin after I started eating a lot of avocado. And I started not eating a whole avocado. I actually just started off eating like a few slices of avocado and I saw a big difference. So with eating an avocado a day, I have noticed the ability to have all sorts of sugary things around me and I just have little to no craving for it. And if I do have the craving and I do um, you know, break down and have a, a Snickers bar or whatever, I usually afterwards, I, I don't like it as much because you know it'll leave like a sugar coat on my mouth or it'll make me tired or something like that. So it's really interesting how my body has changed since I started putting good things into it. Um, another miscellaneous tip, so you know, like I said, avocado, the absolute number one tip, juicing a second. And then the other thing is um, I do drink hot water with lemon on a regular basis. Um, the cup is warm right now, so <laughs> and it's kind of cold in here. Hot water with lemon, it's said to actually alkalize the body. And when the body is more alkaline, it is harder for the bacteria that eat sugar to live in your system. Some of the big things that live in your body are yeast, and yeast craves a lot of sugar, but yeast cannot survive in an environment that is slightly alkaline, which is the environment that hot water with lemon um, helps you get. All right, guys, I really hope that you like this quick tip for Motivation Monday. Next week, we're going to talk about negative complaints, how to deal with them, how to learn from them, and how to improve from them. So if you like this video and you wanna see more like it, please give this video a thumbs up. Also post a comment, I'd love to hear from you, and I will see you next Monday. I love you so much, bye. Let's stay connected guys, no matter where you are in the world, join me here every Monday at 6.30 a.m. Eastern Time for the weekly nursing pre-huddle before your regular huddle. This will help you start your week off on the right note. Also, get email notifications as soon as the videos are published. By joining my email list, you will receive 25% discount on my best-selling books. The first book, How to Succeed in Nursing School, has been called the best nursing school preparation guide for thousands of students just like you. Many say it's a must-read before entering nursing school. In this book, I share how I went from a very average student to graduating nursing school with honors. It also includes tips on how to choose your nursing school, how to be successful in nursing school, and how to stay motivated and driven while in nursing school. The second book, New Nurse, How to Get, Keep, and Love Your Nursing Job, is an outstanding book to help nurses start their careers on the right foot or rekindle their love for nursing. We all join this profession for altruistic reasons, but sometimes the stress of the job has us beaten down. This book, I promise, will help you reignite your love for the amazing work you do. And finally, by joining, you will also have access to a 40% discount for my How to Study for Anatomy and Physiology program. In this program, I share how I went from a C average student to two semesters later was on the Dean's List. I've shared these tips with thousands of other students and they have phenomenal results. Click here for information on how to join my email list. And oh yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel also. I'll see you guys next week. Love you. Bye.